I, I, I got raised in the black church. He knows I'm not kidding. I got my education for real in the black church. And that's not hyperbole, it's a fact. I uh, was sort of raised uh, in the Puerto Rican community at home, politically. It's a large, mo very identifiable Somali community. I might add, if you ever come to the train station with me, you'll notice that uh, I have great relationships with them because there's an awful lot of driving cabs. I probably uh, went to shul more than many of you did. <laughs> You all think I'm kidding. He can tell you I'm not. He got the first sort of mainstream African American yeah. who was articulate and bright and, and, and clean and nice looking. You cannot go to a 7 Eleven or a Dunkin' Donuts unless you have a slight Indian accent. It's a brilliant. I'm not joking. If you have a problem figuring out whether you're for me or Trump, then you ain't black. Have you taken a cognitive no, test? No, I haven't taken a test. Why the hell would I take a test? Come on, man. That's like saying you, before you got in this program, if you take a test where you're taking cocaine or not, what do you think, huh? Are, are you a junkie? What do you say to President <laughs> Trump who brags about his test and makes your <laughs> mental state an issue for voters? Well, if he can't figure out the difference between an elephant and a lion. Young black entrepreneurs are just as capable of succeeding given the chance as white entrepreneurs are. But they don't have lawyers, they don't have, they, they, they don't have accountants. Poor kids are just as bright and just as talented as white kids. What you all know, but most people don't know, unlike the African-American community with notable exceptions, the Latino community is an incredibly diverse community. Romney wants to let the, he said in the first hundred days, he's gonna let the big banks once again write their own rules. Unchain Wall Street. They're gonna put you all back in chains. The three congressmen you have here, two of them look like they could, they really could and did play ball and the other one looks like he could bomb you. I will once more return to the hollow ground of Yad Vashem to honor six million Jewish lives were stolen in the genocide and continue, which we must do every, every day, continue to bear witness. To keep alive the truth and honor of the Holocaust, horror of the hol Holocaust. I just have one thing to say. Here I am. <laughs> All right. There you go. Dance a little bit, Joe. Come on. I tell, you, my man. <laughs> I tell you what, if I had the talent of any one of these people, I'd be, I'd be elected president by acclamation. <laughs>